This is NAB Show Live. Hi, I'm Michael Robinson, and this is NAB Show Live, produced by Broadcast Beat. My guest today is Chris Bailey, CEO and co-founder of File Catalyst. Welcome to the show, Chris. Nice to be here. Nice to have you, sir. So, what new and exciting features or solutions does your company have to show at the eager attendees at NAB this year? So we're releasing a new version of our product File Catalyst Direct um, and our products File Catalyst Workflow. Um, both of them will have completely revamped UIs, more modern looking. Um, we're also looking at introducing new licensing methods. Uh, so traditionally, uh, software like File Catalyst is licensed perpetually with annual support and maintenance. But as we know, things have shifted more to cloud and SaaS based. So um, keeping with the times, we're now going to be offering a, a new consumption-based model where you're charged per gigabyte uh, per file catalyst, and that'll be launching as well uh, at NAB. So this is all about storage, yes? Yeah, it's, it's about uh, you know, moving files between various storage, and a lot of vendors have uh, moved their software solutions to the cloud, and hence uh, you know, data has to follow. So how do you get that data from your previously on-premise uh, software solutions to the cloud solutions. We need a fast way to do that, and that's uh, that's part of what we're doing. Uh, you know, at, at NAB this year is is showing customers how they can move that data from one site into the cloud very efficiently. I see. So, how has your company reacted to this change in the broadcast landscape, and what has it done in terms of innovation for solutions to your clients? Well, as you mentioned, it's all about the storage. Um, when you move a, a solution into a SaaS platform, whether it's running in Amazon or Microsoft Azure, uh, you, you typically integrate it with the cloud storage as well, the public cloud storage. So over the last few years, we've spent a lot of engineering hours uh, integrating our solutions in with the public cloud storages like uh, Amazon S3 and Azure Blob. Um, so what we'll be debuting at NAB is integration with a few more cloud storages like Google Cloud Platform and Oracle uh, Oracle Cloud Storage as well. Uh, so that's on, on that side. We've also um, introduced new marketplace offerings uh, in Amazon and Azure where you can pay per hour to use our software. And it kind of, you know, lumps in with what I mentioned earlier, you can pay per gigabyte now with our software. So uh, a lot of users with this new, you know, the, the transition to the cloud have decided that they'd rather, instead of paying for the up front capital expense for software solution. They'd rather pay as they go, as they use the software, much like they would with a utility. So that's what we're catering to uh, this move to the cloud, is just making it as seamless as possible to move the data from one location to the other in the cloud. Mm -hmm. And also having licensing schemes that make sense to today's users who want to just pay for the software as they use it and not when they're not using it. I see. Makes perfect sense. So does Filecast have any solutions in place that empower broadcasters with the ability to leverage remote editing, for example, uh, scenarios and workflows for live events? Absolutely. Um, and you guys are probably aware we just did a press release with NBC Olympics that uh, we're powering all the file transfer for the ongoing uh, Olympics. So we, we're currently doing that. Um, but that, that, that uh, scenario that they're doing translates to live sporting events of all, all over the place. Um, what people typically want to do is save money by leaving parts of their production team back in their, their head office. And uh, to do that, they need to get the files and the feeds that they're recording in a venue back to their head office very quickly so editors can, uh, can, can start working with that video content. So um, part of what we've done over the last few years is really enabled uh, customers like NBC Olympics to, to edit these, uh, these types of files, these MXF files that are growing um, and that we transfer the files as they grow so they can start editing them in near real time um, as the events are still occurring. Well, I'm glad that you're part of that solution because I'm looking at the Olympics every night. So without your ability to transfer data in such a rapid fashion, I think I would be at a loss, right? You'd have a few less highlights to watch, I think. <laughs> Chris Bailey, CEO and co-founder of File Catalyst, thank you so very much. We're going to see you at NAB uh, South Lower 11516. That, that's South yeah. Lower 11516. Thank you, sir. Thanks for having me. My pleasure. Have a good day. Have a good day as well.